Hi everyone. First, the biggest question. What does El Consejero mean? Well, El Consejero is the advisor, and the most important advice this Chicano is likely to give is, first of all, go straight. At least as long as the air ride is not activated, and El Consejero has two of them, front and rear. So it's not just the rear that lifts, which wouldn't benefit the running boards at all. And once the El Consejero is raised to a horizontal position, the exhaust pipes and running boards, which are close to the ground when stationary, will no longer frighten you. With El Consejero, curves are also possible. For those who want them. The curve is not a category in the textbook of a low slung Chicano. The reason we go so far is that many lift systems suffer from imbalance as soon as they are activated. The line of the bike is correct when stationary, for show. When riding, however, only the rear end rises to ugly heights. Now take a close look at the riding pictures we took to prove it. The front and rear of El Consejero are at the same height, the line is correct. Excellente! Of course, that's not all there is to say about our newest Chicano. It wouldn't be a Chicano if we hadn't given it the oversized 23-inch digger front wheel. The digger still has 18-inch rear wheels, and both wheels disappear under the massive Eldorado fenders. They only look so bulky because they are made of GRP. But they offer plenty of room for Chico's elaborate pink striping. The parts list continues in a more Spanish vein, as we have a lot for Chicanos in our program. The Eldorado triple tree with an extra 6 degrees of rake makes room for the 23 inches wheel. The Altoxico handlebars on their old style risers are paired with a tight fitting hydraulic clutch line. The rebuffany fittings with matching stripe turn signals sound more Italian, but it is also Mediterranean. The rear end is even more Spanish with an Altoxico swing arm conversion and hidden disc brake. The pulley and discs in our spoke design harmonize perfectly with the digger wheels. We built the strut stripe multifunction rear lights to disappear into the strut. The side mounted license plate bracket with interior license plate is what makes the clean rear view possible in the first place. Spirit Leather tailored the saddle, which sits atop our Eldorado seat shell, with a lip that sucks into the rear fender. For us it is always an experience a gigantesca to build a Chicano. We can really tap into the full potential. So it's almost sobering when we reveal that a simple FLHCS Heritage Classic was the basis for our conversion. All that is left of the original layout are the running boards, and even these are not the standard ones from the Heritage. Now you have a better idea of the effort that went into our conversion, and it's no secret when we tell El Consejero that good advice is expensive.
on the road. Speaking of which, we are bikers and we love curves. But who is responsible for riding straight if not a Chicano? Columbus discovered America only one way, driven by the westerly trade winds, and that way was straight. Twenty twenty four Joker Fest T shirt Limited Edition, get one of the last one of a kind twenty twenty four Joker Fest T shirts. The event shirts are available at the Thunderbike store and online store while supplies last. Thanks for watching.